Hey guys, my name is Leila Kalan and today I'm going to start topographic anatomy. Uh, we're going to start with the upper limb. Um, the upper limb is divided into the brachial region, the cubital, the antibrachial, the carpal and the hand. Um, I'm going to divide those um, into different videos and we're going to start with the brachial region now. But to start off with a basic mnemonic for the topographic anatomy, you need to know the triple S. You can either write it as triple S like this or just S, S, S. That's the first thing you need to know. And then we move on to the mnemonic for this particular video, which would be <coughs> children by blue toys. Okay, so triple S for all the videos you need to know start for first one is the skin. Uh, then we've got the subcutaneous tissue, which is the adipose tissue. And then you've got the uh, superficial fascia. Fascia, these are the basic things, okay? After this, you move on to the fascia of the particular region that you're talking about. And there are two types, there's superficial and there's um, deep. So then we move on to the superficial layer of the brachial fascia and then we've got the deep layer but it's a sandwich because between the superficial and the deep layer you've got the muscles and that's where children buy blue toys comes. So you've got a C, you've got, uh, let's write them down. So C is coracobrachialis. You've got B, which is biceps brachii, brachii. You've got B again, which is brachialis. And T, which is triceps, brachii. Okay, then you've got the <coughs> deep layer of the brachial fascia. I'm just going to write BF. Um, yes, after this, then you've got the vessels. You can mention the vessels that fall into this region and the bones. Of course, you know the bone is the humerus, right? And the vessels, um, if you know your brachial plexus, you'll know this well. If not, you can just mention some of the vessels that pass through. You could talk about the uh, basilic vein and the cephalic vein. Vein. Then you've got the brachial artery. You've got other veins like the antibrachial nerve, sorry, nerves. Then you've got the median nerve. You've got the radial nerve, the posterior side, and the triceps brachii is also the posterior side. Then you've got the posterior brachial cutaneous nerves and the inferior lateral brachial cutaneous nerves, but if you just mention this, it will be okay. Um, one more thing that you could, uh, like, you, yeah, it's important to know is that the, the brachial fascia, It forms the medial and the lateral intermuscular septa. Okay, so this one separates the anterior muscle compartment from the posterior. So that's the anterior and that's the posterior. That's it. If you like the video, please do give it a thumbs up. And subscribe for more videos. Take care.